Hello, welcome to the Business Plus Overview for December 2022. Merry Christmas. I hope uh, you have a uh, great break. Welcome to the last edition of Business Plus for 2022. Articles included in this edition, selling a business requires a plan. I suggest that you contact any client that you know is contemplating selling their business and refer this article to them and then follow them up to see whether they would like your assistance in the sales process. A reminder that within ESS Biz Tools, you have the selling a business product package that will give you material that you can utilize with your client to help them in this very important process. Remember, most of our clients don't sell too many businesses in their career. It's a new event for most of them and they will need your guidance. The next article is retail or wholesale businesses require a mix of products and markups to achieve a profit target. Last month, we commented on the tradey charge out rate calculator. And this month, we are looking at the retail and wholesale industries, which obviously have various quantities of products with various markups. They've got labor and overheads like all other businesses, but these are all intermixed with the owner trying to earn a profit. It's a difficult process. The retail pricing calculator enables you to assist your client to determine some strategies within the various products so as to get the mix right so that at the end of the year they're going to achieve their targeted profit. You can locate the setting retail price calculator within the industry specific advisory group product package. My suggestion is that you contact your retailers and wholesale clients especially those who you suspect are having problems in meeting their profit targets and alert them to this article and then follow them up to assist them in this very difficult process to get the mix right and for them to understand how it all interrelates with one, one another. Because they've all got star stocks and we all wish that that's all they had, but they've also got cash cows they got problem stocks and they got absolute dogs in their product mixes. And a lot of that uh, dogs is caused through over ordering of stock or repeat ordering when they get down to a certain level of, of stock left within their uh, computerized stock systems. That's a real trap and one that you should be looking out for with your clients. The third article is setting targets and nailing them in the next three months. This is a reminder to your clients that target setting is important and is a prelude to the article will be included in next month's Business Plus relating to the preparation of an updated business plan at the start of a new calendar year. That's an obvious time to do it, especially for any of your clients who did not prepare a business plan at the end of uh, June uh, this year, where they thought they, there was too much uncertainty. Well, unfortunately, there's still uncertainty, but the need for business plans and budgets and cash flow forecasts and projected balance sheets is more important than ever now. So my suggestion is you contact your clients who you suspect are having problems in achieving their targets and follow them up. Encourage them to sit down and identify a few targets, three would be great, that they're going to fix in the next three months, not procrastinate, they're gonna fix them one way or the other. And uh, then uh, check up with them during the three month period. How are they going? And hopefully during that time, they're gonna be able to tell you they have nailed it. And that would be great. And your client will be appreciative because they'll know you're interested in what they're doing, which is very important. The next edition of Business Plus, uh, we are breaking with tradition. We are going to produce a January edition this year, and it will be uploaded to our website on Friday the 13th of uh, January. We're producing it because 
I think it's going to be an, another difficult year and we need to alert clients to the type of services that you can assist them with to improve their businesses during the year. So watch out for it, please. Friday, 13th of uh, January at uh, 12 noon AEST, 1 p.m. AEDT, we'll be uh, uploading it to our website. And incidentally, our apologies for the lateness of getting today's edition out. We had a couple of technical issues, but hopefully uh, you've received it later in the working day and are able to distribute it uh, to your uh, clients and prospects. Thank you very much for your support of ESS Biz Tools and ESS Biz Grants during 2022. I know it's been a difficult year. It's been difficult for everyone. May I take this opportunity on behalf of the team at ESS Biz Tools and ESS Biz Grants to wish each and every one of the partners and team members in your firm and your families a happy Christmas and a very successful 2023. Stay safe. I hope you have a, a good Christmas New Year break. Goodbye.